interesting view, isn't it? Tom Mack, Phil, oh, Phil ain't here, but Phil, posthumously, Val Marie, Liz, Maria, and 90, doo -doo 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 -doo. Kevin S, Mary, BSKY, Angie, Jim Wolf, Captain Lope, Great Day Mom, Venus, Alright, now we're at 63 people. How's everyone doing tonight? I, I bet you can't guess where we are. <laughs> Is that a tough one? Nah, no one's ever seen that before. Right? <laughs> you don't have a clue. Spencer, how you doing? Aaron. Sony. John John. Alright, now we got people. This is coming. This is coming. I wonder if they have a dust on I bet it's nice. I love me some Bellagio. I gotta admit, I haven't been here in a while. I walked by the conservatory a minute ago and it's loud and cranking with the Disney activities. The, um, the overlook by the spa is actually open because they're remodeling everything. But again, a little bit loud. There's not enough people in there to, to dumb down the noise. Of all the places for a Friday, I'm sure it'll be by the time we get back, it'll be a little busier, but it's kind of quiet in here for a Friday night. But I've been noticing that a lot. Town is quiet. However, uh, Caesar stopped over there. They were packed. They must be giving something away. I doubt it, but maybe. <laughs> you never know. And it rained... For uh, like 40, 42 or 43 seconds, you know, got a nice sprinkling on the vehicle. It was windy. I mean, like, uh, back down the hatch is windy about two hours. It stopped about maybe a half hour ago or so. The sun came out all of a sudden. But, I don't know, maybe we will get to walk outside. But I felt like taking some tram and doing some stuff like that. What time of What's up? Maybe I should turn the camera around. What do you think? <laughs> I'm just digging, pulling 10 mega footage. Some of those are huge. But it's like, you know, they should change it. <laughs> I'm all for a change right now. I've been doing that every time I think I'm finished doing that video about me. Uh, let me turn this around. Bonk. What up? Every time I think I'm finished doing that video, Gary with the 10 banana rams kicking off all the super chat activities. Thank you very much. You know, I told you I've been making that video about me ranking and rating according to my own personal taste uh, and experience. All the casinos in town. Every time I think I'm done, I'm like, oh, I, I got a different way I want to spice it up and whatnot. But. Yeah, I got I got some thoughts. You, you'll be interested to hear them. I'm just gonna not I'm not gonna do a sliding scale, one to ten, two thumbs up, all that kind of bullshit. I'm just gonna say my opinion about each and every one of them. But it's not ready yet. Jim West, what's going on, Jim? I was driving my Range Rover <clears throat> that you sent me all the way from the UK around my kitchen, living room, and whatever. Holy cow! I never drove. You know, I never did that, backwards, reverse, and but that's why I will never, I flew some remote control gliders back when I was younger, you know, I used to catapult them with the giant rubber bands and stuff, but you had like, if you just let go of everything, because it's a glider, it would just like cruise into the next town or whatever, you know, it wouldn't like, eh, bam. So that's why I would never do that, because you need, you need ridiculous, like, I, I don't know, because when it's going away from you, you're like, yeah, left, right, backward, forward. 
but when it's coming towards you, your brain just has like a a thing. Like drive, you ever drive an outboard motor with the, the thing and you gotta do it behind your back and you almost flip the thing over? It's like the same thing. And that thing is fast. I mean, when you go full, there's like, you could tap it, do, do, do it like this, or full throttle. Full throttle, it goes across my whole house in like three seconds. It's like, doom. <laughs> it, it's fun. I put some rechargeable batteries in it so I gotta have all the fun. But I've been driving it and, you know, I'm trying to figure it out, you know? And then maybe I'll get to mount a GoPro on. <laughs> that would be the ultimate. I gotta see how long the batteries last, though. But it's fun. Thank you very much. I love toys. I'm, I'm just a big old kid. Yeah. Yeah, I, but if I did a Brain Drover video now, all it would be would be me crashing into shit. Like, um, I got it kind of stuck like near the dishwasher, it kind of like <laughs> wedged itself in. And it can climb. It can climb up. I made a little ramp for it to jump, you know, and it would jump. It, it, it's cool. It's cool. It's a lot of fun. Yeah, so I'm, I'm having a blast with it. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, da -da. That's all. <laughs> yeah, man, that was, that was awesome. I mean, now my, uh, you know, my desire to own a real one is like dipped by like 59.2% because I'm just having fun with it. It goes across carpet, it, it's, it's fast, it's got traction and everything. Yeah, I had fun with that. <laughs> but I gotta like, I gotta up my, I gotta up my uh, remote control skills so I don't embarrass myself. The whole video would be like crashing into stuff. <laughs> but it's durable too. The other cool thing is, when you're cruising, the headlights come on, and when you're reversing, the tail comes on and everything. It's, it's pretty boss. It, and it's, like I said, it is fast. <laughs> Which is totally cool, too. Alright, so, let me, uh... Just as I say the place is dead, it's getting a little loud in there. So that's cool. Maybe if it's not too windy, we will walk around, but I want to head that way. I want to do a little uh, tram cruising, perhaps. DC. Hey, Bert, what's going on? Kyle is in the house. I want to say all the hellos. Do, 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 do. I think I got everyone. All right, so, is it Friday night? It is Friday night. Um, so, that means I got to invite you to like, share, and subscribe, and hit that bell button to get notified when I do this again, which is at least five times a week and if you want to support the channel you know what to do i got links oh i changed that does that look better the heybrofrederick.com i kind of like i did the the dual caps you know i think that looks better it's easier to read and i got that and i got that i got that and i got the hit and the bell and all the rest of that shit and i got my own platform streaming platform oh i'm gonna check something and it's called HeyBrawFrederick.com. Go check that out. There's a link to uh, go watch yourself a free video, too. I put up a video yesterday on my platform. Probably kind of controversial. It's not my video, but I've had it for quite a few years, and it's interesting. Go check that out. And tomorrow I'm putting up another one in the, uh, how would I say? Um, what's one of my categories? Dating, mating, and romance. Check that out. It's a short one though, but check that out. That's coming tomorrow. Chris and Frank. Do, 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 do. Marta, how are you? All right. And of course, Super Chat while I'm live is the grease that keeps the wheels rolling. Yeah, check out the HeyBrookProject.com activities. So yeah, now you're gonna start seeing more of the, uh, you know, as well as the live streams are coming out, evergreen content's coming out, AKA, you know, pre-recorded videos you can watch forever. All right, let's turn this around. See what what? You're probably tired of staring at me. You're tired of staring? <laughs> tired of staring at me? <laughs> but we got stuff to talk about. Mr. JC Family. We got all sorts of stuff to talk about. We got to talk about, oh my God, we got so much to talk about. We gotta talk about the 99 cent stores. What am I gonna do? This is catastrophic. 
no more 99 cent store. You know, and I was watching it. They posted it, you know, like 50 things went up today all over Facebook. Oh, my God. And people are like, oh, if that place, uh, oh, nothing was ever 99 cents anyway and all this other shit. And I'm like, oh, you know, that's nice that you could shop at Sprouts and pay like $4.99 for a five-inch cucumber. Good for you, you know. But the rest of the world is going to bemoan that. <laughs> I'm not bemoaning the frickin' Tropicana. You know, F that place. <laughs> they should turn Tropicana into a giant 99 cent store. You know, be done with it. But I was I was shocked when I heard that. So what did I do? What did Paul Frederick do? He ran over to the, the, the one, like, straight up in the hood by me. Okay, um, and there was a big sign when I got there that said, because they announced today that they're going to be clearing out all their stuff. Wow, that's such a strong smell coming out of that. Ooh, a Christmas tree. What up, Christmas tree? Shout out, Christmas tree. Hey, you know, we got five-inch cucumbers. Persians. I hate cucumbers. But anyway, I digress. So I went there and they're like, nope, uh, everything, the giant sign in the parking lot that said everything here is full price. So I'm like, F it, let me just go in there anyway. I drove the freaking 15 minutes to get here. I'll go check it out. What up? Oh, <sighs> hell was that? Sounded like a f- way you did on Facebook and in the news. I was like, whoa, they didn't even tell you? They're like, nope. We all came in yesterday, we were watching the news, and that was that. They never made an announcement, they never put it up on the employee bulletin board, board nothing. Just F you, you had to find out by the news that your job is gone. <laughs> it's like, dang, bro. That was, that was I, I felt bad for the cat, but you know, it is what it is. He'll find another job. And then the other thing was, there was a bunch of other Mexican cats behind me. There was a Mexican family, a couple other Mexican people back there. And you know what they were talking about? It's kind of loud in here. F Biden. <laughs> like, they were like straight up, they're like, got duped. And I'm just like, I just wanted to hear the conversation. And they're just like, you know, we got all this, you know, blah, 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 bullshit talk. It's like, the, it was the worst thing that ever happened. I was like, wow, cool. <laughs> it was cool to hear, what I say? Critical thinking, you know? So yeah, that, that, was, that was a good thing. Of course, you know, I cheered him on or whatever. I was like, see you on election day, bro. <laughs> yeah, but anyway. They just had shit there, but I saved so much money on so much stuff. I'm Cardinalis, which is all, it's good quality, you know? I mean, it is, how would I say? It is probably closer to, you know? But they got all name brands, you know, like a, a jar of Prego sauce. It's, you know, $1.09 or whatever. Walmart's like four bucks. Look, oh, look at that. It is. You know, like Q-tip, oatmeal and almond, you know, keeps my skin squeaky clean. And that's like 99 cents for the big bar. You know, the true four ounce bar, not the bullshit one that Walmart sells you for twice the price. That's only three ounces. You know, stuff like that. So, saved a ton of money there. So that's kind of beat. That's BDAF. And I'm like, when are, you, when are you giving all this shit away? He's like, listen, we probably won't have to. You know, because people are going in there thinking, hey, you know, I will buy this stuff. At Whoa. Yep, windy AF. Let me try to shelter you from it. I bought like five rolls of tape, you know, for like every tape dispenser I have. I got erasable magic markers, like all that type of shit. You know, it's basically free up in the dollar store, the 99 cent store. <coughs> I, 
got some stuff for the new studio that I know I'm going to need. Those foam, those, those black, that's some bullshit. And they closed every store, like throughout the United States. Not just the ones in Vegas. I know a lot of people going like, oh, I never shopped there. That place is whatever, whatever. Well, you know. <laughs> okay, cool. Good on you. If you're too good for the 99 cent store, you don't like money or something, that's cool. Look at that. Store, I think, what's the one that closed? Dollar General closed or some other stupid one? You know, so they're all going out of business. So that sent me researching, because you know I'm gonna research. Retail. You know, the retail economy. Do, 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 do. Wow, wind effects. All right, I got plan B coming up. Hold on. <laughs> so we ain't going outside. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. And then I will continue what we was talking about, which is basically the end of the world. No more 99 cent store. That I went to were awesome, especially because they had produce and like. And they had like a gluten-free section and it was an Asian section and it was it was cool. You know, like uh, name brand oh, what do you call it? Uh dollar nineteen. It was the freaking best. But not anymore. In my, in my budgetary concerns. I gotta see what that adjusts out to be. So I went, uh, I went looking into the retail sector today. To reports and whatever. So, based on what happened with 99 and the other dollar store. Target now, Target, who used to you know, they used to try to, um, Wicked Spoon, oh, that was good, how you doing? The, uh, oh. uh, how about you watch where you're going? I'm not going to check the You know, they will always try to attract the higher-end crowd, you know, the Target crowd. And they announced two are going to attempt to turn the store into a dollar store. They think that's the way. 
sales from uh, their more affluent clientele, upper middle class and above, to be getting worse. So they're going to try to pick up this. And you know what Walmart said? Walmart said, we're going to up our game and our prices and try to bring back the Target crowd. <laughs> They're switching uh, clientele, per se, which is kind of interesting. If you don't want them, I'll take them. <laughs> you know, they all think they can do better. Like that one opens it. You know, that's what's going on now. So, yeah, that's a trip. Rip. Did you guys see what, what I posted on, on X? Well, someone else posted. I reposted it. It was a, it was a baby chicks. And I didn't do that for shock or to gross anyone out. I did it to show people that, uh, you know, supposed vegetarian. You know, pigs are not vegetarian. Horses are not vegetarian. Cows are not vegetarian. You know, they're opportunistic omnivores. Just saying. So I kind of shattered a bunch of people's dreams. Oh, it's fucking weird. It's fucking weird. Ahead of us. That was my face mask during the shutdown. I had a Punisher mask and I wore it everywhere. Except <clears throat> what else did I read? Uh, consumer spending is way down, except for the very, very, very high end. Duh. You know? But low end spending, everyone. Kind of crazy. All right, let's check out the weirdness. And I raided uh, the hotel. Whether I consider them friendly or not. You know, so some of the some of my ranking system might Dumb. Well, how do you You know, that's some, that's some bullshit right there. It smells good over here. Oh, is that one of those red heifers that they're gonna... Right after the eclipse? not going to be in here long enough to get on that Wi-Fi. It kind of blows, too. It's blowage. Falling like it's March May. Shoe out of here. All right, I'm gonna connect to that Wi-Fi. I've had enough of this bullshit. Hold on. It's trying.
Ahmet Rutu'yum. Megabitage now. Maria with the five banana ramas. Thank you very much. Do appreciate that. Working our way towards parking covered. I don't even want to go outside in that wing. We'll, we'll poke our heads out a little bit. Just not a lot. Just a tip. talking about something. <laughs> to help replenish the dollar store set. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm bummed. I'm actually bummed. It's like, what am I gonna have to do? Like, what a shit, all, like all the little sundries from where? Freaking Amazon? Amazon's, I'm almost ready to tell them and kiss my ass. They give me a couple of problems here and there. But we shall see. I might even make it. If I don't have a resolution from them soon, I might be making a video about my experience with them as an influencer. What is that? No way. Let's check the menu. I can't even read that. They got flowers on their heads. It's like a tapas spot. Get something from there. Get something from that five dollar vending spot and blow all my super chat. I don't think so. Zuma. Let's check out Zuma. Looks like a pretty alright place. Yeah, I have some interesting comments to make about this in my review video about the Cosmo. Cosmo activities. I mean, this is a nice place. I like dark. When I eat some cow, I want, I want to do it with the lights dimmed. <laughs> That's just me. It just tastes better. Let's admit it. Send a super chat to say it's real. <laughs> That's one. I'm surprised we got connection over here. <sighs> it's peaceful up here. I'm digging it. Damn, banana rounds from Dylan. What's going on? Thank you. I appreciate that. You are friggin' awesome. And do all the hearts and the likes and stuffs. Yeah. Oh, now it's all peaceful and quiet. I like I like my women like I like my coffee roasted. <laughs> what does that mean? Like a little on the darker side? Right. Get on board with that. Get on board with anything. Except one say, I don't need no man. They're roasting themselves. <laughs> oh, tea party. Cool. 
Ooh, that's not that good. I don't want me touching that at all. Gotta get some of those for the house. So no one touches my stuff. No smoking. Oh, she's just a Tom Mac. Oh, that's from Val Marie. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Val Marie. Via Tom Mac. We were just over there a couple minutes ago. It was kind of trippy. It's about roasted wrong. <laughs> it was supposed to be toasted, boasted, floasted, mosted, toasted. What rhymes with roasted? Besides toasted, toasted and roasted, closted. <laughs> what do you like, you women? Like you like roulette tables with zeros and double zeros. Oh, we could play this. Hold on. She'll be coming round the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming round the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming round the mountain, coming round the mountain, coming round the mountain when she comes. How you doing? <laughs> yeah, you, you dug that, huh? I got mad skills, right? <laughs> cool. Where's he going? Is that employees only? What's an exit? Where does that go? Oh, that is staff. <laughs> that looks staff-like. That are everywhere that a lot of people don't know about. We just hang out here for. Look at this. It's no music. My eye while I was editing a video. It was kind of trippy, it was like this. It, it had that whole steampunk vibe and whatever. But it was interesting. Uh-oh, security heading my way. Boop, boop. Let me pretend I'm looking at this here. Let's pretend, let's perpetrate the fraud. Uh, da, 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 da. The bang bar. Hmm. Bang bar sounds interesting. All right, enough fraud perpetrating. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's mad skill. Mad skills. Oh, there's another level. That looks like the inside of a cantaloupe. Oh, can we go up even further? What's up there? All right, let's let's perpetrate some more fraud. Um, let's see. What do we want to eat tonight? Block sixteen. Block sixteen sounds pretty good. Uh, or egg slut. Alright, it's close clue. Yes. Alright, let's find out where this goes. <laughs> Angie, with the 10 banana rounds. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. I don't think we've ever been up to the fifth floor before. What is this like? And. Two bananaramas from Val Marie via vicariously. I polished it. Yeah, I got some freaking sanitizer. Wow, wow, let's see the freakiness here. What is this? The click. Would be your click, yo. Not a lot, but it suits down here. It's getting even more interesting. Oh! Everything's from Val Marie tonight. Thank you, Angie, for felicitating and uh, facilitate, felicit facilitating that transaction. That was awesome. Yeah, this is like definite parts on the oh. Never been up here. 
Oh, here's some, yeah, that's very steampunky. That's exactly what that movie was like. Don't watch it. I'm not telling you to watch it. It wasn't worth watching. Just curious if anyone wasted. Watch it. Oh. Oh. What is this? Signal is not too strong up in here, but. Kind of a, ooh, that's glass. I don't want to drop that. What in the satanic ritual bullshit is this? Well, what, what is this all about? What is this? What is this? I could, oh, no way. It's like cement. They're, they're real cement. Oh, the chain mail's cool. I'd like me some chain mail. Go to battle. Yeah, that's some. What is all this? This is interesting. Oh, there's a bathroom down there. Okay. I'm sure they know we're here. We're just exploring. I am the key to your lock. That's what that floor is saying. What the? What the? No. That's like some cannibal bullshit. No, pass on that. See, that's what I always say about this place. This place has some... Love it. But there's some darkness going on in here. Okay, well, anyway. Yeah, there's definitely some darkness going on. Oh, that looks like one of those old fold-out maps when you were like a kid. You know, your most trusted map reader how to get shot. Doing the turn and all that. Yeah. Yeah. The Nolita. Check out some more. This is this is weird. I mean, you could fit like a hundred people in here for the whatever whatever demonic ritual they're about to perform. There go your chairs. Holy shit! Quartz. Freaking elephants skating on a piece of quartz. Yeah, it looked like a subway map exactly. I'm. <laughs> you guys will see on the new channel. I'll let these. Let's see how the poor Frederick lives. Do, 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 do. I like trying to knock Tom for his hotel selections, but there is some weirdness going on. Oh, what's this? Alright, bathrooms. Like, what is this? Reception. All right, where else are we going? Do do. Listening to the the lyrics, but it's got a nice it's got a nice vibe. It's appropriate. I'm probably getting copyright claimed like a freak right now. Did we go that way? We didn't. Wanderer behind me, unless he's U C. U C, bro. Doo -doo. Like secret freaking hallway. We're on like the freaking 39th floor or something. There are some more spooky ass crystals. 
Look. Oh. Oh, no way. Hold everything. Hold everything. Feet are soaked. All right, don't look at my sneakers because I'm wearing my comfortable ones, but look. Wait, wait. This floor is soaked. Oh, look at it. Look, 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 look. Watch this. It's even more soaked over here. <laughs> you see that? That's trippy. Oh, that was a good one. that all day. Oh, you hear that? <laughs> My feet are so... Yeah, I have some more freaking... Uh... Yeah, that looks normal, right? <laughs> okay. What if that's where they cleaned up some DNA? What in the phallus symbol is that? No, it wasn't coming from the ceiling. Nice flat tummy there. What up? High heel calves. All right, cool, cool. Wow, my, my feet are soaked, but it was worth it. That was fun. What are these, a bunch of amoebas? Oh, you know what these are? These are eyelashes. From chicks who came to Vegas. Look, exactly. Those are eyelashes. Those are those giant freaking eyelashes that all the women swear. Yeah. Eyelash art. Right, let's check out the rest of the art. That looks like Mick Jagger blowing a kiss. Oh, that's a picture right there. What up? Guy playing peekaboo up in there. What is this? Is this like out of one of those books they're giving to the kids in school now? How to do stuff? I think we've approached dead end activities. This is kind of cool. Could have watched F1 from up here. <laughs> interesting. Very interesting. I heard Ocean Prime is pretty good. those in the house, different color. I think we've run out of places to go. There's only one place to go, and I'm just down. What is this? Should I press a button? Found something, something, there's a little something, something going on over here. I, I don't wanna go in there. That seems like trouble. There is security heading my way, so I have to... That is interesting. Is this security? Yeah, I think it might be. So let's admire art. Let's play Stunard. I'm going to let them catch up with me. But... In 2000... No, it's charcoal. Yeah. I mean, you gotta admit, the skill is intense. 
to be able to do that with a piece of charcoal. Like, they just nail the eyes and the variety of skin tone and everything. I'm getting good at that, huh? borderline getting blocked. Maybe that's something they're into. Not me. Do, 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 do. This closes down in emergencies. Wow, there's a lot of like stuff over here. All these hidden places that all say staff. Happy Friday, Tom. We're doing like a, a deep exploration. I feel like freaking Lewis and Clark up here. This is upon us. Christmas is in 263 days. Oh yeah, look at that, it's vinyl. More, see that one? Oh, it does so, they all say staff. Based on some of this stuff. Did we go that way? Yeah, we went that way. Right. Let's make like a tree of leave. on what's happening. Sylvia. Tom Hill. It, it is the, the decks here. Is, the deck here is cool. Having access to a deck is pretty awesome. Shout out decks. <coughs> Upper deckers. Alright. Mortal engines. I don't get the whole the whole, uh, what do they call that? Steampunk? Yeah, steampunk. I mean, it's, it's a, it's a... But I wouldn't like dress all steampunk. I don't know, that's like a big sub, subculture. Signals should get better. I think they're performing some type of ritual too. They're all like, they're, they're looking pretty shady. Yeah, see, all. That chick was like, yeah, that's kind of creepy, don't you think? Do, 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 do. sat there about a hundred a good place to like take a load off it's got those little uh, little desk thing and it's good people watching too extraordinarily good people watching yeah, she's all happy Ooh, yeah how can a hair do like that the other day? <clears throat> but with the front bangs very thin, like they used to do in like, I don't know, back in the day. <laughs> Does what smell? Up in here. It smells cosmo -y. Yeah, there's some more weirdness. I beaded that up. I 
took the hats and deities. What's up, girl? Oh, it's a battle rancho. The ghost donkey? No. I love this picture, too. I think that picture is awesome. Vicky gone. Victor Bor. Exactly, there's a convention. Never been to a convention over here. That's more accurate. We're talking about the body counts. Does smell good in here. Hmm. Could stand some coffee, but I think I'm gonna wait till I get back to the Bellage. Just the two of us. We can make it if we try. Just the two of us. It's what? Question is why? Alright. And some sausage. A gaucho, a cheeseburger. I guess that's fairly affordable. House gluten free bun for a dollar. Oh, right. That changes everything. We might have to check out some egg slut activities. I'll spend an extra buck not to die. Alright, that might that might be a thing we have to do. What are their egg sluttery hours? Does it have their egg sluttery hours on here? Ba 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 ba. Oh, then it says on the bottom, oh, we can't guarantee that there's nothing in here. What are their hours of operate? Go eat a $15 egg McMuffin. I swear I would never. Cool. Got an overwhelming, fabuloso smell in here. Should I go down? No. I didn't put on my MC jacket one time this winter. I mean, I'm glad it's still nice. It's probably like 40. It truly got cold. But it is going for the, it's going for the length. So I'm alright with that. Yeah, we did that. Done did that. Jessica Parker. All women's lives then. <clears throat> then, then, then. Ugh. That whole sex in the city thing was an abomination. It ruined like two generations of women. Be good. Mm -hmm. Guess we gotta go back this way. I was a little confused. But she was. The 
very first true influencer. I know. She sold more like high end filtered, you know, teeny boppers can do. She was the OG. The OG is what is, oh, they made this out of room keys. I wouldn't I wouldn't call that art, but I would say uh, dexterity and patience. Greg, what's going on? It's like been brainwashed by Sarah Jessica Parker too. I might do a video on my other channel about the damage that that show has done. It just taught so many horrible behaviors. It also taught women how to disassociate themselves from responsibility and responsibility to money. Had that lifestyle that she had on what she was getting paid. <sighs> yeah, I should do a video on about that. Stone dogs. Went through some ritual. Who is this? Faded. Nah, let's see what that's all about. Who's paying? Solo cup crew. Solo cup activities. That's some weird shit too. Secret hand signals to get in there. That's that speakeasy. Do, 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 do. Alright, I'm gonna have to do 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 down the hallway because it is. I think I'm already screwed, but it is what it is. Yeah, what a trip. Or is it? Is this an illusion? Is this deflation? The concept of deflation and that's what we might if we're lucky we'll slow but they will certainly never get back to what they were it's just it'll be like a getting you but they won't increase but that isn't that always the way shit works though get the sheet I can't talk about DP, but sheep have great wool. Ba ba da ba ba ba. I think this is the third one I got in an hour. <laughs> We're gonna have to get on their Wi Fi. Just give me a second to accomplish said task. Alright, we're, we're good. That was a smooth transition. Yeah, I mean, I'm.
Come on now. It's a strange phenomenon. Radio signals getting blown around by the wind. I gotta stop and drink some water. That's what I have to do. Let's do some people. Nothing like the initial login. All subsequent logins to house Wi-Fi in Las Vegas are not as good as the initial one. I wonder why that is. I have no explanation for it, and I'm kind of in the biz. Ah, water. Yeah, that signal blows out there in the wind. Tomorrow night I got something interesting planned. If it's not stupid windy. I poured water like, I dripped water like it's kind of near my junk, it's weird. People are going to be fixating on that. So look, it came down from like the outside. Rock. It's not like that puddle upstairs. Yeah, isn't that a trip? Earthquake on the East Coast. I was there one year when there was an earthquake, which is very abnormal because, you know, East Coast is sitting on bedrock. Probably has something to do with the eclipse, you know, the four horsemen and all that. Man, this bottle is dripping. What's up with that? I think I popped it seal. Oh yeah, populations are shifting. I think, I think what a lot of people would like to do would be shift back into the more rural areas where it's somewhat safer than the cities. But that's a whole different thing. Oh yeah, that's right, you're in Connecticut. You probably felt that. They said it was centered in Jersey. 4.8, which sounds very, I mean, it is significant, but it's, it's, earthquake ratings work on a, an order of magnitude, just like decibels, like there's a giant difference between like 90 and 95 decibels and, you know, 70 and 80, it's exponential. Oh, she's looking at my wet spot. But it feels nice. It's cooling me down. <laughs> Dude is getting a vasectomy when the earthquake hit. I don't know what happens if you're like not an earthquake hit. I was here in Vegas during, uh, uh, there was one not too long ago, you know, oh my god, it was an earthquake. I mean, shit shook around or whatever. But there was one back in the early 2000s, the last time I lived here, that was strong. And I was standing up at the time in a business, in my business, and the sensation was like a wave. It's like if the ground turned liquid. I mean, it literally there was a roll that came through. Didn't like demolish anything, but it was like a, it was, it was trippy. It was like if the ground turned liquid. 
I can't even explain it, but I will never forget that. Let's poke our heads outside. Let's go see the rest of the wind. What up, Chris? Chanel for show. I do certain inflections for certain people's names. I don't even know why. This is fun. It just makes sense. Chanel for show. I don't know why. It just goes with the name. Didn't have to touch no door activities. What are they playing out here? Wow, it feels damp. It feels very damp out right now. Maybe we stay connected up until around here somewhere. Let's chill over here. Like, I used to have a good inflection for only you can be you. I don't see her around anymore. She hasn't been around in months. If you're out there, girl, what up? Yeah. Can you hear whatever shitty band that is? <laughs> what are they at now? They're not shitty. They're just not my taste. <sighs> Yeah, okay, so you've been, Tom, you know what I'm talking about. It was just like, just like the ground liquefied under my feet. And like, literally like my right foot went up and then went down, then the left one went up, like the wave. It was just like, it was like if you were on a surfboard or like had a surf, I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. I think it's kind of indescribable. But that was, that was kind of nuts. Isn't it kind of nice out? Looks kind of party tonight. Look at these views. What? Moist. <laughs> oh, you experienced the 89 San Francisco one? Yeah, maybe I feel damp because my feet are soaked from that. I don't know what took place up in the Cosmo. Have I ever driven in one? Yeah, I actually I have. I actually have been in one of those, like, uh, oh, no. party mobiles, you know, with all the lights and the LED and the bar and the poles. <laughs> yeah, I've been in a couple of those. I almost bought one once. Me and a couple of my buddies were contemplating buying one back when I had the martini bar slash cigar bar slash lounge slash food establishment we were going to bring people because it, it was way off the strip we were going to contemplate using it to bring people to the place from the strip but that never came into fruition fruition but yeah I've been in those not, not recently though I don't know what they're like now Hey, freaking Caesars would send limos to come pick me up. I'd just call them up. I'd be like, yep, feel like playing tonight. They'd be like, uh, give us an hour. <laughs> and they'd send a limo. And that was pretty cool. Or, you know, like a, a Lincoln Continental. But mostly a limo. That was, that was pretty boss. That was back when they used to treat you. Or they'd call up and they'd be like, hey, bro, Frederick. would be like, what? They'd say, man, you got to get down here like now. There is the fishiest fucking poker table ever. You got to be here. You got to get some of this money. And I'd be like, all right, <laughs> come pick me up. I'll be down there. I'd say, keep them in one place. <laughs> they'd say, don't worry. 
And sure enough, there'd be some freaking fish, you know, just like itching to lose money on poker. That was mostly at the Bellagio. And I'd go down there, I'd house them all, and then, you know, I'd dupe the person who called me, you know, a good 10, 20% easily. That's when I didn't mind tipping, like the hand pays and stuff. Now it's just like, what? You need 20% of my $1,204 for carrying a clipboard? No. <laughs> Sorry, you're not. You didn't tell me to play this machine. Back in the day, you know, they'd walk up to you and they'd be like, hey, bro, where did we move the machines around? You see that one over there? It's like nearly 100%. You're like, all right, cool. <laughs> They don't do shit like that anymore. So, you know, what What does everyone feel so obligated to, like, hand over your money so fast for carrying a clipboard so you can pay taxes? Yeah. But hey, bro, Frederick, it's good karma. Yeah, well, if you believe in karma, we have to have a whole nother conversation. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, that's what I figured, 59, 40, I got a nice, uh, I'm warm, <laughs> what time is it, 7, 7, 20, alright, cool, let's just chill out here a bit, how you doing, Ron, you living a life, yeah, the ring of fire, mm-hmm, it won't be an asteroid that takes out the U.S. It's going to be uh, the super volcano at uh, Yellowstone Park. That's going to take out half the planet. Two banana rows from Joe. What up? Can you tell <laughs> I, I can't tell that story again. I, you know, honestly, because it was related to, uh, you know, that specific subject. The last time I told it, it didn't, it did not go over well with white tape. But can't really do too many of them here. Because that one was related to, uh, you know, the 420 activities. But I do appreciate the two banana rounds, and I will give you a baritone, my chick. Do 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 do. Oh, who done knocked that over, bastards? What a good citizen. He probably knocked it over, but still. Yeah, a lot of people don't know that there is, is a, I think the world's largest super volcano is in Yellowstone. Why do you think it's so geologically active? But when that thing goes, which it will, someday, one day, it's going to be, <laughs> it's going to be pretty bad. Is this Noah's Ark? They're trying to make fun of my man Noah? No. It's the Hermes. Flagship. The flagship. The sky will be black forever. All vegetation will die. We're all going to starve to death. But Mr. Gates has us covered. He'll have us eating bugs before that. Whoa, is this loud. Damn. No, I won't. Back down. Whoa. What's up with them? Being so freaking loud. All right. Copyright claims it is. Copyright claim activities. Do, 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 do. Leave your worries at the doorstep. Man, I gotta go whiz like a racehorse. Well, 
like a cow whizzing on a flat rock. Yeah, I said it. <laughs> some adjusted vacations. Some California vacations. All right, people, that was fun. You think? We did some exploring. Can't go outside. You know, couldn't. Did our best to be outside, but couldn't do it. Yeah, well, that was that was that was a great story. But like I said, didn't go over too well with uh, YT. Oh, the spanker is gonna be brutal tonight. But I'm okay with it because you guys got me covered. I got, at least I got some parking covered. That's all that matters. All right, people. So tomorrow is... What is tomorrow? Tomorrow's Saturday night. So I got something planned. If it's not windy. I want to go check out something. I'm not even going to tell you. I'll keep it a surprise. Because if I can't do it tomorrow night, I'll do it another night. But it'll be fun. You know, it'll be interesting. Another deep dive into some dark corners of Las Vegas. And I'm thinking to... I have a meeting, uh, I think next Tuesday, right over by Ellis Island. So we might go have breakfast at Ellis Island. It's an early meeting. So I'd probably be done by, I don't know, like 11 or something like that. And then uh, maybe we'll do breakfast at Ellis Island again. That's always fun. So, uh, two banana rams from Maria. Thank you very much. I do appreciate that. All right, people. I'm going to jet. So one last time, I'm going to invite you to like, share, subscribe. And hit that bell button to get notified when I do this again, which is at least five times a week. Get it on a sports channel. Right there. HeyBroadFrederick.com. Not the channel. That's supporting me directly. Because that is my streaming platform where I am raw and uncensored. You can say all the stuff, talk about all the topics that you want to talk about, that I want to talk about without any censorship. That's why I started it. And of course, the cash app, the Venmo, and all that other good stuff. Links in the description, yada, yada, yada. All right, before I get another 99 copyright claims from whoever this big band is here, let me get out of here. Love you guys. And on that note, we're all Frederick out.